2006. <clears throat> Along with him, seven soldiers in his unit were killed in this deadly battle. Roy Klein, a commander of a Golani unit, was killed at Kiddush Hashem when he leaped on a live grenade acting as a life shield for his soldiers. For this heroic act, Roy received the Distinguished Honorary Award. He was buried in his 31st birthday, leaving behind a wife and two sons. Major Roy Klein was a Golani Brigade Deputy Commander. He was killed in an ambush among the houses of Bing Jebel, a large village in southern Lebanon. His terrorists killed seven soldiers, including Roy, and injured nearly two dozen. There were two other soldiers next to Roy. A hand grenade was thrown at them, and Roy shouted, Grenade! He then threw his body over it, mm -hmm. sacrificing his life for the sake of his soldiers. In his last second of life, Roy mustered the strength to shout, Shema Israel. Mm -hmm. The prayer that Jews have prayed for centuries, declaring our believing God, and in a better world. The prayer that so many Jewish martyrs, martyrs, martyrs throughout the generation called out as they were being led to their death. Yeah. Roy was there to ensure peaceful existence of his people in their homeland. He was there to safeguard the innocent lives of his children and his nation, to ensure that people could live in their homes in peace and tranquility, to guarantee that they could continue their ordinary day-to-day -day lives, activities like shopping in a mall without being blown to bits, like eating a family meal together in a pizza shop without worrying about flying traffic, like praying in a synagogue without having to run for cover in a bomb shelter, or like sending their children on a school bus without thought of bullets penetrating with them. Roy was there to defend his people against those that vowed their destruction. Even in his death, he sacrificed, he sacrificed his own life to ensure that two of his comrades could live. Yeah, here is the flow of the book.